Have you ever stopped to think about where your old carpet goes after you replace it? The vast majority, about 90%, is dumped in landfills. About 5% is incinerated, and less than 5% is reused or recycled. So much carpet is being dumped into the ground that it represents 3.5% of American landfill waste, or about 4 billion pounds a year. This is a bad situation, especially considering all the toxic chemicals found in carpet. In landfills, carpet biodegrades very, very slowly, while also leaching dangerous chemicals into the ground. It also contributes to methane emissions and takes up a lot of space. When incinerated, carpet often releases pollutants, disruptors, and hazardous chemicals like dioxin, mercury, and lead. Carpet is often incinerated in lower income neighborhoods, which means that nearby disadvantaged residents are the ones who often suffer from higher cancer rates, heart attacks, strokes, pulmonary disease, and asthma. Luckily, many carpet suppliers are looking into carpet recycling as an alternative to dumping carpet in landfills. Hi, my name is Jennifer and I am the Director of Operations for a floor covering store in the Northwest. And around 5 billion pounds of carpet go into landfills every day. We are only one company, but we can make a difference by changing how we've done business. Our company researched a local recycling program that accepts any type of carpet, so we feel very fortunate. We purchased a truck and containers to be able to accept the used carpet back from installers after it's been taken out of homes. This is something that our customers and our labor has appreciated. We will continue to look at ways to recycle as much carpet and waste materials that come back from job sites as possible. We are lucky to have such a close facility that will accept post-consumer carpet. Many parts of the country struggle with this and don't have this capability. Sweet.